Yep. All right, good. Offensive line, you know, looked like they made some strides mm -hmm. against Duke. What did you kind of take away from their performance? Well, I, I think we saw some improvement in the uh, pass protection. You know, where Brandon had a couple clean pockets there in the game and was able to stand in the pocket. And then, you know, as, as we tried to move the ball down the field a bit further, you know, he was able to escape and extend some plays. But I thought they did a good job there of giving us a chance to throw the football. You know, um, wasn't like we wanted to be in running it. You know, we got to be better with some pad level things and cover some guys up, create some more scenes for the backs. The backs got to hit it so we can so we can operate in that fashion as well. And then it looked like y'all were mixing a lot of guys in on the offensive line. Are they comfortable, you know, just kind of switching guys out there right now? We have no choice but to be comfortable because that's just what we have. You know, it's no different. Than it's been that way all along. And, you know, uh, rotating in uh, Justice and, and Ty just to get those guys, you know, not only opportunity to play, but – I mean, Ty, you know, not asking him to play 80 snaps. Even for Justice, not asking him to play 80 snaps. So we practiced that way, so those guys are playing that way. You know, Noah got in a little bit um, and did a good job in there. Just got to continue to build some depth at, that, at those spots. Those guys are practicing that way throughout the week. I mean, it's week – now we're in, what, week six, you know. So got to be prepared in case someone gets nicked up because that's it's really been what's been happening around here, you know, since I've been here, right. There's always somebody up and down the old line, so we got to prepare guys to be ready to play. You said that Brennan was had one of his best days yes. from a comfort level. What did you see when he watched Carroll about his performance? Just calmness in the pocket. You know, he's he's always been a guy that can extend plays with his legs and escape the pocket. But he was calm in the pocket, getting the ball out on time, rhythm fundamentally. And so it, it showed up on Saturday night for us. Sean Wilson is yeah. on the depth chart this week. Delaney yes. Crawford was kind of yes. warming up. What kind of those athletes can bring yeah. to the table for but, help out the wide receivers? Yeah, it's again, you know, you, we self-evaluate, right? And, Dontavian is averaging you know, high number of reps, right? 70 plus reps a game. Right? That's a lot, particularly over the course of a season. You know, uh, KT's playing a lot of reps. Lavelle's playing a lot of reps, right? And, you know, it could be impacting. Hopefully it's not, but maybe that's impacting some of the production and stamina. And, you know, we get, a, get out here on Saturday, God forbid, say one of them get nicked up. We don't want to put, you know, JR or whoever the next receiver in the game, and that's their first time that they're doing something. So we're trying to prepare these guys you know, throughout the case of the week and, and take some load off those other guys, try to keep them fresher so they can play with better stamina and more production throughout the whole game. Made a couple adjustments the last couple of weeks, mm -hmm. quicker throws, yeah. quick games, stuff like yeah. that. Do you think that's helping, you know, the line and Brennan? Oh, yeah, and certainly. Getting comfortable? Yeah, certainly it is. You know, we got to find ways to move the ball, right? And, you know, how you may have thought it would be looked like at the start of the season changes, right? And um, that's what goes back again, you know, getting the ball in these guys' hands a little bit quicker and, and see if they can make plays for us on the perimeter. And it ties in with the protection. We don't have to protect as long. VA can get the ball out on time. And, you know, it's reduced our, our sacks here lately um, from the start of the season. So it's just a work in progress. And now we just got to, you know, translate it, put more points on the board, get into the red zone. When we get to the red zone, we put points on the board, you know, with the exception of ODU, we'll turn the ball over down there. So, you know, we just got to be good in that plus 50, you know, plus 40 to the, get in the red zone area. Now we get to put ourselves in the chance, uh, in the position to score points. When you look at Louisville, what stands out about their defense? They're athletic. You know, they've always been athletic. You know, they're playing an odd front and they're going to move and slant. And they're athletic. So we just got to, again, nothing changes. We got to play with great details and fundamentals. If we do that and execute, then we'll win. All right. Thanks, Coach. Thank you.